Serena and, and Venus have ass. But it looks like if you bounce a quarter on it, it's going to bounce off. Yeah, well, apparently, he's a rapper from like... He, yeah, he's like from the Bay. He's a rapper from the Bay. But girl, who took the picture? I don't know. I don't remember. I don't know. Holy shit. She's going to bow our heads and press. Oh, boy. Say hey, bitch. Little guy. Bless Jazzy with a little bit of boob, too. <laughs> My drunk ass slugs my leg over the fucking chair. <laughs> Climbs on <laughs> the bed. Bitch, <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even get out. <laughs> Thick bitch. Fuck. No, she didn't have to come around me with all that ass. I and just wanna, is it bad that I almost want him to get his ass beat after that shit that he posted up on Instagram? Oh yeah, about his. He deserves thing. an ass beating. Yeah, you was telling me about that before I really interrupted you. Apparently, she got an abortion with his babies, and he tried to expose her because he seen her somewhere with some niggas. And in that show, he seen her with Nelly. He got mad and was like, "This is why I broke up with you." But it's Cause Nelly. Because she had an, cause she had an abortion. You're talking about the, the broad, the, uh, the cute ass Hispanic. That yes, we have. she's bad. Duh. Super bad. Oh my god. And she I'm said, "Hey, with your crazy babies. Do you have any rent? I always have rants. Oh, hell. What happened? I hate that I rant about real life situations because sometimes I feel bad for the people that I am ranting about because some rhyme or way, I feel like, you know, I either speak to them again, see them again, and then I know they're watching my shit, and it's not like I wouldn't tell them to their face because everybody knows Jazzy, and everybody knows Jazzy will not hold tongue. But... My vents. The fuckery that goes on in my damn building after 12 a.m. is ridiculous, by the way. Okay, listen. There was a random man. He looked like a damn rapist girl. What a dog. Smelt like one, too. Crazy. Talking about, try, talking about, I'm trying to get up in the fucking room. Or I'm trying to get in the building. Or something crazy. It got hot in here, right, y'all? Hold on. I know. Let I me put this shit down. The window because we cannot right now. Exactly. It got mm -hmm. hot up in here, right? And then I opened the window, and all of a sudden he's like, "Hey, hey, hey!" Because he's trying to get in the building, and I guess he after have we've a already in. told you, no, gather, girl. I have a question for you guys. I have two different ways that I feel about this. Um, Dre's body looks amazing. Does it? It does. Yes. It does. It does. But. We all know Drea has either gotten an implant or injections of some sort, right? How do you all feel about women in injections and women in plastic surgery booties? Plastic surgery as, as a whole. I wouldn't get no fake titties. I got enough. But I might consider injections. Because... You can get them in more than one place. You can get them in your boobs if you want. You can get injections in your hips. You can get injections in your booty. You can get injections anywhere. And, you know, like I keep telling everybody, I used to be a very big girl. I don't want to say very big, but I was big. I can be able to say, probably, that I lost 20 pounds. So, but then I didn't get blessed with this huge ass. But I don't like big girls with no ass. That shit looks crazy, doesn't it? I was talking about them last week, now wasn't I? So how are you going to be a big sack with a flat back? I don't get it. I don't know. But God didn't make everybody my way. I'm sorry. And this bitch got a tank ass. And I'm just like, why wouldn't I? I mean, like, I don't know, Shay. Like, <laughs> I can give you high school. <laughs> you <didn't> say tank <laughs> ass. <laughs> Look, I, in high school, I can say, I used to have a really petite body. We all had those high school stories about how we was a size, blah, blah, blah. I was a size nothing, and I had this ass, and I had these titties. I was put together, okay? Got pregnant, had my baby, and then it was like, whoop. No ass. Whoop. It was gone, girl, like gone. Gone. As I was pregnant, I'm like, the more I lean, the flatter it gets. What the fuck? Mm. So now afterwards, she's striving to get her back, and it's not the same. I think I'm going for the, for the gusto. What y'all think? What you think? I, I, think I like being able to sit down. I know it's only like a two, three week process, but honey, uh-uh. Uh-uh. I do too much blogging. I do too much typing. I have to sit a lot. I'd be damned if I have to stand up and type. It's not happening. No. 
Uh, all I need is a little bit of hips. And there's a lot of women with my body type that don't really have hips but just have ass. It's not very often that you have ass and hips unless there was like some type of an injection or something to keep it all. Uh, or unless you're like Latina. A lot of Latina women have the ass and the hips and everything. Just kind well, of a lot of black women too have a lot of ass and hips too though. Like I've seen it a lot of times. Be like, you thick bitch. Fuck. No, she didn't have to come around me with all that ass. And hips. <laughs> you stupid. That's some bullshit. <laughs> some bullshit. That's one thing I did not get blessed with. Anymore. Yeah, no, I just lost all my boobs. Take that. Take take it. Take the thing. <laughs> take it. Because these back problems, I can't do. Okay? These back these back problems are just way too much. I yeah, can't do that. have knee issues. Like, I have really bad knees. This motherfucker's heavy. I'll take the knees. Oh, bitch. Girl. Because proportion-wise... I'd rather have ass and titties. I'm just saying. You can I don't like need a, you walking around looking like a big ass panda bear, bitch. Okay. I'm trying to be. Used to. Equally even. Is that wrong? No. I'm just saying. So, if any prayer that I have this evening, we're going to bow our heads and pray. Oh, Lord. Bow head, bitch. Lord God. Bless Jazzy with a little bit of booty patootie. <laughs> she ain't trying to eat cornbread. She ain't trying to eat rice. She ain't trying to eat neck bones. She ain't trying to do no squats either, apparently. Jazzy does over 200 squats a day. Let's just say that. Well, then why don't you keep doing your 200 squats a day for another month? And then girl, we ain't finished food. praying, girl. We ain't finished praying because God didn't hear me. Lord God. At the end of these 200 squats, Lord God, please help me make the decision not to go see a doctor. I'm trying not to. But unfortunately, she's on her way. I need you to work your will and get Jazzy a couple of cheeks. That's all I'm asking for is a couple of cheeks. Okay? In Jesus' name we pray. She got issues, y'all. Amen. <laughs> She has so many issues, you guys. It's ridiculous. <laughs> it's not fair. God, and I've been considering, and now I'm seeing Dre. I'm like, that photo. So you just gonna constant constant something? Know. I don't know, but I've been following him on Instagram for a while. That girl pulled her little self up in the simplest outfit, crossed her legs, looked forward, and it was magic, Drea. bitch. Dre, girl. Referrals are needed. Okay, I'm just saying. Yeah, that or a workout plan, something. Because she used to post her workout photos. No, no, Shay, I do. I okay, listen. Because she has dope abs, dude. She really does, and they're womanly abs. Now, girls, like, don't play. She has dope abs. Serena and, and Venus have ass, but it looks like if you bounce a quarter on it, it's gonna bounce off. It might hit you back in the eye. It might smack your ass in the shit face or some shit like that. No. I'm just saying. I need to have. My ass needs to be supple. And then it's I don't want you to be scared of my ass. No. And you know what? I want a realistic ass too. Because some of these women, it's like, girl. And I want to ask that if I'm on TV, my ass don't look potentially fake and it's really real. Right. Like, so this just Nikki. I love her. She has swag. We all know that. Or K Michelle. And you know, K's ass is originally big, but I think she went too far no, trying it's to go. Not originally big. No. Did you not see the old school photos of her when I she did was in the old dress? And but I see before, before she got, got her even teeth huger. fixed. There's photos of her before she got her teeth fixed, before she got her hair done, and before she had even less ass than you. The girl was skinny. She, she looked crazy. She was skinny. Huh? She looked like she belonged on a farm, didn't she? Hold on. I guess it's not that big of a deal. It's not that big of a deal. But it is something that I would, you know, especially with a small torso. It's kind of like you have to spread out somewhere. You can't be straight down, SpongeBobbing and shit. No? Okay. I don't want to be SpongeBob. What do you guys think? That's why I'm happy I have a smaller waistline. Oh. Yeah, I am. And you guys, listen, it's been a struggle. My weight has gone up and down 
for the longest time I've always struggled with my weight and the fact that, oh, girl, that's not her. She did have a little bit of hip and cake, but she definitely did something. Don't play. Are those her teeth? Is that real? Yeah, bitch, there's a video of it. That's a screenshot of the video. Don't play. Y'all, she didn't see the K Michelle before for the fucking, what was his name? Uh, hold on. Memphis? 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 Toya's husband. Y'all, before he got to her ass and fixed her teeth and gave her ass some ass. He was like, bitch, you can sing. Oh, you're actually kind of cool. Is that how it worked out? Girl, they like dated or some shit. I know I they know did. That. that Apparently, that's the one she keep talking about beat her ass, right? Mm-hmm. Ooh. She didn't even look like a country bumpkin. Oh, you see what he said? Stop shopping together. We don't. Look here, bank. Don't you fucking come for me. <laughs> I bought this shit today, and apparently she already had that shit in her motherfucking closet. Don't make me come find your ass. Stop yeah. shopping together. Listen, <clears throat> why are you in Vegas turning up? Why don't I fucking drink? Fuck. Shit. You know what? Don't worry about where the fuck I shop since your ass went to Vegas and didn't fucking take us with you. He did tell me to come in. Yeah, he did. I can't even front. Damn. But still, you and Vegas, <laughs> stop it. <laughs> Any more randomness? That commonness? Mm -hmm. They ain't here. I'm glad they did. I did. Nope, it's a figment of your imagination, bitch. You know what's going to scroll across that screen? Hmm. Put your phone on <laughs> silent. <laughs> <laughs> I put it on silent now. Shit. This doesn't happen on purpose. I think it does at this it point. It just happens that way. No, seriously, like my phone never rings. Like I never put my ringer on, but I'll put my vibration on. And then I just don't think about it because I won't hear it sometimes. A lot of the time I don't hear my phone. Unless it's on something and vibrates. If you know anyone that can direct me and my boo over here to Summer Jam, preferably day two, backstage all access passes, let us know. We'll pay for them. Ain't no thing. Just saying. Just let me know. Shit. <clears throat> I've been having a pretty decent week. I was just going to say that. Shout out to the Juice Girls for having a decent week. These kinds of things rarely happen. Okay? And I'm pretty sure there's like a few things that we can rant about. But they're not really worth ranting no, about. my only frustrations is people on the road. The shit pisses me off. Like, I get sick of having to bob and weave. I feel like I waste gas having to drive like that. But, whatever. It's part of the life. Random Facebook moment. Somebody just posted that their girlfriend just got locked up. And I'm like, what? Why'd you post that? Your girl? Hell, what's she doing? One of the people said, shouldn't have had her out there, huh? Oops. Oop. Well, then, in that case, moving forward. <laughs> and the popos took his phone. Nothing will make the news if it's not a Mayday riot. What do you mean, nothing will make the news if it's not a Mayday riot? All these fucking shootings that go on the news so retarded. I hope I don't sound crazy when I say this, but this is Washington. You know, this is not one of those low poverty states. Like, a lot of people beef when it's in poverty because they're hungry. You know what I mean? Or they're mm -hmm. angry that they live in poverty. But this is not one of those low poverty states that people need to be playing all this mess, you know? Is it bad to say I don't understand how you're broke in Seattle? No, because there's lots of opportunity here. Like, I can understand being like, hey, I don't get paid until next week. I'm a little bit down. But how are you genuinely broke in Seattle? Mm, I you guess. guys don't yeah. even know. Last weekend, we must have went out. And then I woke up in the morning, and I'm going through my phone. And I'm seeing all these pictures that were taken with my phone and they weren't necessarily taken by my hand so that means that my drunk ass dug in my pocket handed my phone to my <sighs> my gold iphone 5s to a stranger she did that and got some pictures of us she did that and i woke up in the morning and he was all happy i remember the whole shit i don't i'm like uh 
Okay, they had us doing some shit, and I don't know. I didn't do it because I was had, I was so loaded. I didn't even know who the dude was in the fucking photo. So I was like, "Who's this?" I was like, first of all, when the fuck did we take this well, picture?" Well, that would happen to be who dude. took the photo. I don't remember who took the photo. Girl, I don't know. And then I was like, "Who the fuck is the dude in the photo?" I mean, he, we now follow each other on Instagram. Apparently, he's a rapper from like. He, yeah, he's like from that. the Bay. He's a rapper from the Bay, but girl. Who took the picture? I don't know. I don't remember. I don't know. Holy shit. I was wasted that night too. Don't get me wrong. But I, I remember I think that I was the main one that they were worried about because I had to drive home. <laughs> and I drive home. Y'all have no idea. Okay. Listen. Okay. We drove her car down there. And I drove. She drove there. But she parked. I had to park and drive us home. Yeah. But I had to drive me home. <laughs> so when we got back to my car, I was scared as hell. I'm like, bitch, no, you're not okay. Wait, no, you're you not okay. to leave your car here and I'll come back and get you in the morning. I was like, ain't nobody got time. I only live to the way. I'll be fine. She was like, girl, I'm worried about you. <laughs> I was scared. I'm not even going to shame. I'm like, well, here, drink this water or something, girl. Do something. I was like, if you don't get them. Y'all, my drunk ass fucking... And, and I do not condone drunk driving, but shit, sometimes it goes down that way. My drunk ass slugs my leg over the fucking chair. <laughs> climbs over the chair. Bitch, you didn't even get out. <laughs> I was you didn't get out. And she's talking to me from the outside door, and I'm still sitting in the passenger seat. I was like, if you don't get no. out of my car, when I know the way. I was, just climbed over. No, <laughs> girl, what made me scared? Cause you see, I sat there for hella long. Yeah, you did. You was in my way. That's what I remember. Girl, I was standing at this woman's window, and she was cracking the fuck up. <laughs> and I'm like, what the fuck is she? Like? <laughs> oh yeah, I was loaded. When I get yeah, really, really loaded, I would just start laughing. I was like, like I why remember. is she dying laughing so hard? What is the tea? <laughs> I remember when I was like super duper loaded off of rum and I was getting out of my cousin's car and I fell on the ground and I like I laid in the gr- in my driveway and I just was laughing and in the fucking driveway. The fuck and my cousin was like, get up! <laughs> that was on the listen, whatever cousin she talking about, girl. <laughs> we here. We done been there together, girl. We know in this house. Do girl. you even remember the call to turn off the alarm? Yeah. <laughs> That's one of those things that's like riding the bike. You know what I mean? You doing some things? No, but that shit was crazy. 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 I made it home though. <laughs> and she did the next day. She was talking about she worried about me. Bitch, I was worried about you. <laughs> I was like, I haven't heard out of you all day. Where were you? I was worried. Girl. She said, Bitch, you was worried. I was worried. <laughs> Girl, I was worried about show ass. That's what I was like. I was like, oh shit. She was like, no, you ain't driving us back. I'll drive. <laughs> Girl, I wanted to drive this bitch home so bad. I was like, I'm gonna just take you to my house. And then the I must have looked at her so crazy when she said, I'm gonna take. Girl, I'm going in my bed to sleep in my I know, but at fuzzy least, p- fuzzy sheets. <laughs> at least I was being a good person. Oh, I and know. It was genuinely from. It was her. genuine. But she got a genuine drunk reaction. Yeah, like a bitch cracking up. And you have no <laughs> idea what the hell is funny. You're like, girl, like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Did I miss the TV? Oh, that when you were like, I am worried about you. Like, girl, I was like, girl, <laughs> what the fuck was funny? You guys, I had like seven fucking shots of fucking vodka. Mind you, night. this is the person, whoever took the pictures, He, it was on him. Just saying. No, that was at... I took like seven shots of... Uh, oh, at the pre-funk game. Yeah, at the, of Ciroc. I didn't drink shit when I was down there. You didn't? Where were all those... Why were all the... There were like hella just drinks on the table, girl. The Mexicans was drinking that shit, bitch. Girl, they bought three shots for us. And I was like, get that to them. I ain't drinking that shit. Well, shit, if I drink You don't, it, remember, I don't remember drinking that? I took a shot. Maybe that's why my ass was so tore up. <laughs> I don't even remember. I talked to this bitch. I was like, girl, you mix it? She said, girl, I'll be all right. I don't remember. <laughs> Shout out to Jazzy.
Jazzy Red because she was my accomplice that night. Okay? She had to watch the whole shenanigans. Okay? We both and then, like, and then, then, let's not talk about the freaking dude that was trying to rub up on me that night because I was freaking loaded as hell. She was like, if you don't get your ass over here. I was like, what? <laughs> now. <laughs> Girl, you know when you talk to somebody without moving your teeth, bitch, you're no, like, get your ass over here. Get your ass here. here. Now, bitch. <laughs> yeah. uh, I was fucking roaming around like a motherfucker. She said, no, that. he wants to smoke, so I'll be back. I did? No, you what? <laughs> bitch, we're all going up and green to sound crazy. Is that how we ended up outside? Yes, bitch. That's how we all ended up outside, girl. Oh. Why is all this tea just now coming to the surface? Because we haven't talked about it. We didn't really talk about it, girl. I was like, girl, my hair hurt. My hair hurt, too. I'm going back to bed, bitch. All right, bitch. I'll see you later. Mm-hmm. What <laughs> you have to realize is that fucking Friday night we recorded last week's fuckery. Then we didn't get home. I got home at 530. I'm sure she got home at 6. Then we had to wake our ass up in the morning, do some more shit. She decides to come to my house at 2 o'clock in the afternoon unannounced before my ass even gets dressed. I was like, bitch, I gotta do something. Bitch, I'm in the head. area. I was thinking, I got no clothes on. Mm-hmm. Bitch, I'm in the area, girl. I was like, bitch, I was I should just my clothes. She was like, put some clothes on. I was like, I need to wash my ass, bitch. I've been loaded all day. Are you serious? Put on some clothes. <sighs> I'm gonna hit you when I pull that, bitch. We need to edit. Ah. <laughs> Can I just be drunk for a moment? No. So we did that shit. Then that night, we fucking go out. Then I have my little drunken night to where my ass is After fucking... getting a random text. Because at first we weren't going to go out, remember? No, we weren't going to we go weren't out. We weren't going to go out. over it. And then I get that random text like, be here, I buzz it. So I guess we got to go somewhere. Day two, bitch. And then that night, I got home at about... I mosey my way in the house at like 2.30. She probably go home at like 3. And then the next day I slept in until like 12. 1. And the thin. Here's what shit. Well, I don't want to <laughs> Thank the Lord that my dear Basa is here. <laughs> because that night I was scared she wasn't going to make it home. And you know, me being a... I can't front. I was doing some dumb driving on the way home. Girl. I think I might have hit 80 going down a 35th Street that night. I just know. because I wanted to see how the car was going to go. I was like, what happens if I hit 80? How fast can my car speed? Whoop. Like Mazda. <laughs> what if you would have heard that whoop? Your shit would have been like whoop. Your shit would have just dropped into your stomach, girl, wouldn't it? That's why I float home. <laughs> I don't just float in my head. I float so home. <laughs> Literally. Somebody <laughs> guided me home because they know <laughs> if they don't guide me home, somebody else is going to guide me somewhere else. Cause, mm-hmm. Lord, pray for my fellow juice girl. Not Lord. Y'all pray for my fellow juice girl. <laughs> to the Lord. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> oh my God. I was just getting ready to take a quick little sip. Right before we do our video, or shall I say our radio show, and Jazz asked me, whatever happened to Tamar? Where she go, y'all? And this all stemmed from because I was trying to clear, clear my throat, and then I happened to say something, and that sounded just like Tamar. I said, where is Tamar? Where is Tamar? Where is Tamar? Nice. No, that's Mimi, girl. Don't do that. Girl! Don't do Tamar like that. Girl, but where is Tamar? But I haven't seen though. or heard of anything about Tamar in a minute. I haven't heard about her since her beef with K. Michelle. K. Michelle. When K. And Michelle. And I think she was trying to use that. Well, exactly, because remember, K. Michelle had came out with a song and did it better than motherfucking. And we told y'all about that shit. Did the song better than Tamar, but technically, K. Michelle recorded the song before TC even gave the song to Tamar. And K. Michelle's song. Either hoodles. Where is Tamar? Is she like taking care of the baby? Is she like on a low key tour? Because you know, a lot of times when these artists go on tour and they're kind of like low key tours because they're not necessarily Beyonce, we don't always know about this shit. Mm-hmm. Oops. And so, <laughs> like that. But that's because sometimes they're either prepping for tour or they're just laying low, getting ready for album. Because remember when Jennifer Drake dropped that last one? 
Check her Instagram. He was on a hiatus. I know that's what I'm doing. I'm looking for her uh, Twitter. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah, come on, Braxton. Her. There you go. Well, she's performing. Mm hmm. But it's low key. Mm, her shoes. Life, Tamar. This is what I don't get about artists like Tamar Braxton. Very talented artist. Clearly has a lot of fans because the picture that we just seen that was uploaded a day ago has 32,000 likes on it. But yet, no one's really talking about it. Like, I don't know. Normally, when there's like a lot of. It's kind of a weird appearance. I, I just don't know. Like, she's doing a lot of stuff, according to her Instagram. Clearly, she's doing things. But I just, like, I don't know. Like, are they small tour stops? Or? That's what it looks like, though. It looks kind of like smaller. Like, you know, 200, 300 people mm-hmm. max type places. Where it doesn't look like mid- a big stage at yeah, all. Yeah, no, that's not a big stage. Yeah. So it's like definitely smaller places where they don't necessarily have media to cover. Yeah, potentially. That Even that stage doesn't even look very big. Yeah. yeah. Well, uh, Tammy, come back. Where you go? Girl? I don't know. What I need for Tamar to do is hurry up and come out with... You know what? You're gonna have to listen to Go Juice Radio to figure out what the fuck I want Tamar to do. How about that? And then I'm gonna tell you what I want Tamar to do because uh, I have a good idea for Miss Tamar. She's probably already thinking about this, but she needs to just do it. Exactly. And you guys will be able to hear our idea on GoJuiceRadio.com or on the TuneIn app. And if I'm not mistaken, you can even find the shit on iTunes. Mm-hmm. We will talk to y'all a little bit later. Bye, guys. that I almost want him to get his ass beat after that shit that he posted up on Instagram. Oh, yeah, about his He deserves an ass beating. Yeah, you was telling me about that before I really interrupted you. Apparently, she got an abortion with his babies and he tried to expose her because he seen her somewhere with some niggas. In a nutshell, he seen her with Nelly. He got mad and was like, this is why I broke up with you. But it's Cause Nelly. Because she, she had an abortion. You're talking about the, the broad, the, uh, the cute-ass Hispanic? That yes. We She's bad. Duh. Super bad. Oh my god. She said, like, you with your crazy baby. Do you have any rants? I always have rants. Oh, hell. What happened? I hate that I rant about real life situations because sometimes I feel bad for the people that I am ranting about because. Some rhyme away, I feel like, you know, I either speak to them again, see them again, and then I know they're watching my shit, and it's not like I wouldn't tell them to their face, because everybody knows Jazzy, and everybody knows Jazzy will not hold tongue, but my vents, The fuckery that goes on in my damn building after 12 a.m. is ridiculous, by the way. Okay, listen, there was a random man. He looked like a damn rapist girl. What a dog. Smelt like one, too. Talking about trying, talking about I'm trying to get up in the fucking room, or I'm trying to get in the building, or something crazy. It got hot in here, right, y'all? Hold on. I know. Let me put this shit down. Window because we cannot right now. Exactly. It got hot up in here, right? And then I opened the window, and all of a sudden he's like, "Hey, hey, hey!" Because he's trying to get in the building, and I guess after we've already told you, no, gather, girl. I have a question for you guys. I have two different ways that I feel about this. Um, Dre's body looks amazing. Does it? It does. Yes. It does. It does. But we all know Drea has either gotten an implant or injections of some sort, right? How do you all feel about women in injections and women in plastic surgery booties? Plastic surgery as, as a whole. I wouldn't get no fake titties. I got enough. But I might consider injections. Because you can get them in more than one place. You can get them in your boobs if you want. You can. Serena and, and Venus have ass. But it looks like if you bounce a quarter on it, it's going to bounce off. Yeah, apparently he's a rapper from like... He, yeah, he's like from that. the Bay. He's a rapper from the Bay. But girl, 
Who took the picture? I don't know. I don't remember. I don't know. Holy shit. You gonna bow our heads and pray. Oh, Lord. Say head, baby. Little guy. Bless Jazzy with a little bit of booty too. <laughs> My drunk ass slugs my leg over the fucking chair, <laughs> climbs on 